Zachariah, what can I do for you? They found some ancient documents. Looks like they date back to the settlers, but they're written in a language I can't read. And I thought you technomancers were so well versed in our old dialects. Maybe in Aurora. In abundance, we're soldiers first and last. We learned some colonial knowledge during training, but the languages are barely taught. The Great Master was the only one who had that kind of knowledge. So, now you need a technomancer from Aurora to translate. I might know of someone. A renegade of sorts who left Shadowlayer to become a hermit. Word was, though, your former comrades captured him. If he managed to hide what he was, he's probably a captive in one of their forced labor camps. Then getting to him won't be easy. Exactly. But, if you want your document translated, you might just have to find a way. I think I know the camp Dandolo mentioned to you. It sounds like their main camp, so I wouldn't be surprised if the man you're looking for is there. And I want to go with you. Have a few things to settle there. This is important to me, Zachariah. What they do to the prisoners there is inhuman. I just want to help as many as I can. You're not telling me something, are you? I was a prisoner there once. I can't tell you what they did to me. I'm just asking you. Take me with you. I get why you'd want to free him, but it also makes me nervous about letting you tag along. If we get there and you let your emotions run away with you, it's my life you're risking, too. You know me better than that. You've seen me keep my cool in the worst situations. Think about it all you want, but I'm the one who knows that camp by heart, remember? It's gonna be more dangerous for you to go in without me. expected this camp judging from Nisha's face not something pretty I feel like I'm driving a hearse whatever you're thinking it's a thousand times worse you're taking us to hell but aren't they called work camps more like prisons where the primary goal is to break spirits and destroy free will their final products are submissive beings akin to farm animals and their methods end up destroying some and brainwashing the others. I wonder if we'll find Charles. Good chap indeed. Didn't you tell me he was on vacation at one of these camps? Far from it, Scott. That's the fake excuse his assistant was given. Charles is most likely detained there. If he's at this camp and he's still alive, we'll find him. This Aurora Technomancer we search for must be hiding in plain sight. He'll be very discreet, so we'll have to look for someone normal. Almost too normal. I hope we're able to free the other prisoners. We could help them get a fresh start in Noctis. I know you want to sit with the cool kids, but my rover can only hold so many people. Sorry, can't take everyone. If we can distract the guards, I can get Dandolo to send a rescue team. It wouldn't be the first time he's done that. If Dandolo can bring the manpower, we can bring the diversion. We'll free them. my hatred for this place. I warned you. You misunderstand, Zack. Coming back here free, armed, with my rights returned to me, it's priceless. Thank you for bringing me here. I can't tell you how much it means to me. 
be able to force this lock. I need a key.
Unfortunately, this is beyond my skill level. If we can unlock this gate, the prisoners can get out and hide while Dandolo sends in backup. I'll take care of that then. The more people we can get out of this hellhole, the better. Need a key to open this door. Nisha, are you all right? Hey, are you Professor Charles Seeker? I am. And you? You are. What is a technomancer one? Long story, Professor. Just know I'm a friend of Scott's. We looked for you in Ophir. Even got our hands on some of your notes, but, um... My research notes? On technomancers? How? I coded them to make sure those ASC thugs couldn't read them. Did you manage to read them? I just gave them to Scott. Oh, good. Good, good. Uh, I'm sure he deciphered them with no trouble. Scott's eccentric, I know. A little unstable. Especially since he lost his child. But even still, he is the greatest mind in abundance. A genius who's focused his research on people like you. Technomancers. I'm sure my notes, which I pray no one but you and Scott will see, will be a great service to him. I was able to prove nothing, really, but my work pointed to a high probability that the abilities of your kind stem from what Earthlings called gene therapy. Not sure what that means, Professor. <laughs> yes, yes, of course. Uh, they modified genes to cure disease, provoked mutations, modifications that got passed on to offspring as well. Look, in theory, at least. A theory I will never get to test now, I'm afraid. Being held here. Well, I suppose it's better this way. Undeniably incredible research, but research that could also, unfortunately, lead to the enslavement of your kind. Cast you as just another mutation to be contained, you know? Afraid of, of what they don't know. And while I'm sure there was good intention in their creation of your mutation, no one can say what that reason is. Can you keep this a secret, Professor? My lips are sealed. Now and forever. No one else will ever be privy to my research. Thank you, Professor. Take care.
Hello. I'm looking for an old man. A technomancer. Oh, you're knocking at the wrong door. There's no technomancer here. See, we're here to think in a politically correct way. Besides, you don't look like someone who's politically correct. Leave me alone. I don't want to go back into the room. Hello, I'm looking for someone. A rather old man. What is the man doing in the camp? He was locked up here because he was living away from corporations. He's a technomancer like me, but way older. And he comes from Aurora. Uh, he is not sure, but he believes he recognized that the old man had the Aurora way of speaking. Uh, but he thinks that the man is mistaken because he is not a technomancer. He doesn't make lightning bolts. He is a mechanic. Not a good mechanic. Thank you very much for the information. Hello. I'm looking for someone. A man? He doesn't mingle with men. Men avenge themselves upon them, so he stays away. All right. I understand. Goodbye. I'm looking for an old man. He's from Aurora, and he used to be a technomancer. Well, you're looking for him in the wrong place. It's true that there's a guy with a funny way of speaking, but I can't believe that he's from Aurora. That sounds crazy. What would he be doing here? Who is that man? His name's George. An old guy, as you said, and the way he speaks sounds funny. Anyway, as if he were making fun of us with complicated words. He's a mechanic, though. Hmm. This could mean that he studied within the elite and a corporation that were a little... precious. Thank you. Hello. I'm looking for a man. A man in your age range. A technomancer. A technomancer? Here. <laughs> you must be mistaken, my boy. There is no technomancer here. The prisoners of war are sent elsewhere. Here we are taught to think like good citizens of abundance. How old are you? Seventy? Hmm. Fifty years old, but I had a hard life. Unfortunately, that leaves its mark. Like technomancy takes its toll as well. I don't know what you mean. I don't know anything about technomancy. You should talk to someone else. I've heard that mechanics isn't your forte. It's a good hideout, isn't it? The person who told you that I'm not good is simply bad-mouthing me. If you say so. But this doesn't explain the way you speak. Polished for a mechanic. Listen, let's cut to the chase. Just let me look at your temples and that'll be it. I? You are the pain in the neck. You know that. Very well. I am the one you are looking for. And your relentless questioning puts me in jeopardy if the word gets out here. I specifically came to this camp in order to find you. You brought back a dome lost in the sands, a tablet that I'm unable to translate. Hmm. It is written in the settlers' coded language, one they use for the important data. By all means, I can translate it, but this type of thing can take time, and I can't do it here. Come with us to Noctis. I am sure that you'll find a place to stay. Noctis? city of the merchants. It's an independent city. There you won't have to fear Aurora or Abundance. Well then, I'll follow you. That's fucking amazing. And hilarious. Guy manages to hide who he really is, a fucking technomancer from Aurora, right under the noses of the worst assholes in Abundance's history. I don't like Aurora, but damn. They're all that fucking wily. I can fucking get how they beat us. I don't care where you take me. Anywhere is better than prison. It stank like fucking death in there. I don't know what to say. I feel ashamed. I'm from abundance. What they do to people in there... Inhuman. To think that even Ophir looks like a paradise after seeing such a place. I am grateful, however, for we managed to save a few souls. 
You okay, Nisha? No, not really. I don't want to talk about it right now. I get that the place could have triggered some bad memories. I'm sorry, Nisha. Hello, this is Patience, the Technomancer you told me about. Ah, nice. Free of that shadow-forsaken labor camp. Must have been a living hell. A sincere pleasure to meet you. Yes, nice to be free, but to be honest, I'm now stuck with no place to go. Can't and won't go back to Aurora. And Abundance was always so accommodating that I can imagine the hospitality if they had known about my talents. Damn the ASC. And ever since my little desert refuge has been discovered, it's become a tad less cozy. Here I am. No roof. No real belongings. Only thing I have is this guy here who won't leave me alone until I translate some ancient text for him. Well, I can't help with Mr. Mansor's needs for a translator, but I can give you a roof. It's the Noctis way, for we say, give me your tired, your poor, your huddled masses yearning to breathe free. Welcome to your new home, Patience. There are some empty houses in the northern part of the city. I'm sure we can set you up there. Thank you, and a sincere pleasure to meet you, Dandolo. Looks like patience is gone. And judging by the mess, I doubt he left willingly. Bet you all the serum in the world the fucking ASC's behind all this. They need to be stopped before they overrun Noctis. And I need to find patience. Fuck, and the tablet. 